Hey there, survival enthusiasts. Welcome back to The Prepper's Path. Today, we're diving into a crucial topic for any prepper, water filtration. Clean water is essential for survival, and knowing how to filter water can make all the difference in a crisis. Let's get started. First off, why is water filtration so important? In a survival scenario, access to clean water is vital. Drinking contaminated water can lead to serious illnesses like dysentery, cholera, and other waterborne diseases. Contaminants in water can include bacteria, viruses, parasites, and harmful chemicals. Filtering your water ensures you remove these dangers, making it safe to drink. Now, let's talk about the different methods of water filtration. There are several effective ways to filter water in the wild or during emergencies. Boiling water is the simplest and most effective method to kill pathogens. Just bring your water to a rolling boil for at least one minute. Portable water filters like the Life Straw or Sawyer Mini are great for on-the-go filtration. They can remove most bacteria and protozoa. Using iodine or chlorine tablets can disinfect water. Just follow the instructions on the packaging for safe use. UV light devices like the SteriPen can effectively kill bacteria and viruses in water. Each method has its pros and cons, so it's important to choose the right one based on your situation and available resources. What if you don't have any commercial filters on hand? Let's explore a DIY method for water filtration. You can make a simple water filter using a plastic bottle, sand, charcoal, and gravel. Start by cutting the bottom off the bottle and inverting it. Layer the materials inside, gravel on the bottom, followed by sand, then charcoal, and more sand on top. Pour your contaminated water through the filter. The layers will help remove sediments and some pathogens, making the water clearer and safer to drink. Remember, this method is a good start but should be followed up with boiling or chemical treatment for best results. Water is life and knowing how to filter it can keep you and your loved ones safe in any survival situation. Thanks for tuning in. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more survival tips. Stay prepared and stay safe. Subscribe for more survival strategies. Next time we'll discuss why do we need a gun for self-defense, so look forward to it.